Hello, good day everyone and welcome again to our 19th recorded Let's Play session here in Stellaris and currently I am playing the uh, the uh, what do you call this uh, the empire that I have created here which is called the UNS which is the United Nations of Seoul uh, basically it started out as uh, story-wise as a refugee nation or more like a refugee uh, some sort of refugee, uh, I don't know, task force or something um, they're assigned to uh, colonize an extra galactic, uh, you know, extra galactic uh, galaxy, which is the Fornax galaxy. So, okay, I'll uh, just uh, switch on now my uh, menu here. So, the year now is 2376, and our current. Uh, president now for the UNS is uh, General Secretary Vera Ross so he I think he's a scientist from what I recall uh, last time now uh, of course uh, we are playing the uh, the uh, Orion 3.61 here for Stellaris so I haven't updated it because uh, the last update was 3.7 uh, which is first contact, but I haven't put on the first contact uh, DLC here along with the upcoming Paragons But uh, for now, uh, I'm just using the uh, Orion update. So uh, anyway, like I said, I'm here to finish the story of the UNS and uh, Yeah, so currently um, it's peacetime for the UNS. They have just defeated the Uri remnants and it's now in the process of um, terraforming for uh, almost 40 plus of its worlds to a Gaia world and of course the thing that we're going to do now is basically just preparation for the endgame crisis just in case it's now 2376 I expect that at least the endgame crisis would go around at least 2400 at least just to keep it story wise um, construction complete oh okay that's okay I'm just made a mistake with this uh, okay uh, just allow me I'm just gonna uh, I don't know. Uh, make the speakers a bit smaller, I guess. Well, anyway, uh, okay, I, I think that'll do. Uh, as long as I don't, uh, you know, I, I just keep the volume down. Um, so yeah, uh, let's proceed with this. Um, Okay, uh, like I said, uh, sorry, I was distracted a few moments ago. Uh, I planned that the end game uh, crisis here would at least appear 2400 and up. I'm not sure why the uh, end game crisis has not appeared yet here. I I could recall that the uh, end game crisis was sent uh, set here about 2350 or 50 years earlier, but apparently it's been 26 years. Uh, it's still late, so that's okay. That won't be a big issue for me. Oh. What do we got here? Uh, hi Curator, we would like to purchase this service, okay? Now, uh, goodbye. So, uh, in the meantime, we'll just, uh, you know, bid our time in reinforcing and strengthening the UNS military just in case a crisis erupts. So, uh, the UNS and its uh, constituent uh, federation here, which is called the Foreign Axe Union, has now a solid grip on all the western side of the Foreign Axe Galaxy. And, uh, as you can see here, I'm still uh, having issues with my naval capacity. Oh yeah, one more thing that I would like to tell is that every 30 minutes I will be saving this game for, uh, you know, for uh, as a safekeeping because in case that my gameplay here, uh, you know, hangs or disrupts, I still have to just to backtrack only for 30 minutes. So, uh, of course, it's uh, more like a measure, uh, uh, it's a steps as a save measure. Uh, just in case that, uh, you know, my game breaks down and my PC is not exactly that um, it's not exactly that um, uh, advanced or uh, sophisticated. It's sufficient to play sitars, yes, of course, but not that advanced to get the good graphics out of it. So, uh, like I said, uh, I would be saving this for every 30 minutes. Well, what's this? The Storm Rider Prime. Yeah, okay. Um, Okay, we'll just um, create some uh, insults with this one. The Storm Rider, 
this is basically an expansionist hive mind but um, I'm not sure um, uh, about this relations uh, but anyway we have some buffer states here so uh, having an armed conflict with them is not exactly uh, you know uh, it's highly unlikely so uh, I'm also strengthening my armed forces here which is the army last I checked it was 14,000 I don't know it's now small again to 14 11,000 I'll probably have to check with that um, in the meantime, I have low stability with this. I have no idea. Maybe trade value, immigration pool, resources from jobs. Oh, well, uh, I have no idea why. Hmm. Okay, so um, and it has a lot of vacant jobs, but I don't know why. Okay, um. Okay, which ones? New Slovakia, how about New Yemen? New Yemen is still doing good. Um, probably it's because of the... Oh wait, I haven't heard from this one. Okay, so there were some... Uh... Okay, there were some planets that were forgotten to be terraformed. Probably I just lack the energy credits. But uh, rest assured we have this one in tip top shape. And for some reason, my uh, pop approval rating just went down to zero here. Hmm. Not so good. Anyway, it's a fortress world. Stronghold, Odokyan Mon Monument, Hallow Theaters. So it's not very stable probably because uh, New Yemen is not... Uh, oh! New Generation Confederate Nations, okay. They want to secretly make up trade bargaining here. This one. Probably, uh, they don't like being in the grasp of the Sidran Manifold. Yeah, and they want to uh, break away, I guess. Protectorate under Sidian Manifold, Protectorate under Sidian Manifold. Well, we have some wars with the Sidians before with the Midfell issue, uh, story-wise. Oh, and they are, have numerous worlds as well, 42. Huh, well, they're not... Uh, well, they're superior when it comes to technology, but when it comes to military and economy, definitely the UNS is uh, fares a lot better. Hmm. Okay, there's a sentry array there. Also, uh, the UNS has, uh, you know, constructed Science a mega division. project Reports here to uh, to repair a ruined mega structure, a science mm -hmm. nexus, to be specific. Mm -hmm. Okay, for now, we're just basing our research on our... Well, I'm gonna go for Shield Hardener, I guess. Oh, okay, that's not exactly uh, nice. Um, how about... Uh, research Shield team? engineers have cleared a blocker. Okay, so that's uh, good. Okay, uh, I guess my volume here uh, on my PC is kind of broken. I can't really, uh, you know, um, you know, adjust it. Maybe if uh, I go for a short break here, I'll probably have to readjust that. <laughs> okay, uh, just give me a few seconds here. Ah, uh, great. Uh, I'm pretty sure I... Ships refitted. Oh, no, no, no. Just give me a moment here. FN... Okay, so I've got the options here. Yeah, okay. There we go. So, uh... Yeah, that shouldn't be a problem when it comes to, uh... You know the volume so it won't you know tangle up with the recording okay what do we got here uh yidra hmm. yeah well we got some local star bases here new taiwan is doing a good thing um yeah new taiwan Wait, right, i'll just uh Probably the sound quality here. 
Okay, I'll just put it in half. Oh, we can have the effect volume master and me. Okay. Alright. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Just give me a moment here. So I was. Uh, Okay. Yeah, sometimes I have to make a little, uh, you know, uh, tinkering here just to uh, get the volume right. Uh, a few minutes ago, it was too. The volume is too loud. Insurgency underway. Oh God, what's this? There's a new revolt. Okay, this is not very good. Huh. Okay, we're just gonna declare martial law with this one. I have no idea why there's a planetary revolt going on here. Um, it's probably uh, population 11 pops. Huh. Furbanites and the Uri. Okay, I guess the Uri. Oh, the Uri immigrants that was forcefully relocated here. Hmm. Okay. Well, they were clearly quashed within a month or a few weeks, so... Uh, that takes care of it. Okay, we're just gonna add a little incentives here. Just to, uh, of course, uh, convince some folks that moving on New Slovakia is a good thing. Or at least to convince those folks. So uh, for now, uh, we're just gonna go with this. Yeah, New Bahrain wasn't exactly... Uh, Oh, okay, um, probably go and uh, build some industries here. I guess that will be a good thing. New Korea is, of course, an agricultural world. Um, okay, what's this? 12 districts. Okay, we have 12 agricultural districts, so we still have 6. Hmm, I'll probably go with this one. Uh, yeah. Okay, that should do the trick. And, uh, I don't know. Yeah, we'll go for gene clinics. Um, so we're not, I'm not trying to overbuild some stuff here. Okay, so I guess that's it. So how about our armed forces here? Since this is peacetime, um, expect uh, no conflicts, but we should be prepared in case a conflict would erupt. Okay, so this is a little bit of a... Okay, probably I have to convert uh, two of these industrial districts. Okay, so that should put some jobs here for Science the Division report uh, boundary, success. which is a uh, UNS occupied world now. Okay, we've already got kinetic artillery. Inbound message traffic. Um, how about? Uh, yeah, we'll go for um, planetary build speed, so we can you know easily build some stuff. Uh. Okay, we can go with them. I guess we could. I'm just gonna sign immigration treaties. However, there are restrictions for immigration on humans. The rest, uh, we can go for uh, immigration with almost all, all uh, Xeno residents of the UNS are allowed to uh, immigrate to and from UNS. The only thing that's, uh, you know, uh, not allowed or restricted are humans. The rest of the residents, they can immigrate as much as they want. Um, yeah. So it's not 100% uh, immigration. Uh, they're not, on the UNS, it's not exactly 100% immigration policy. Uh, there's always uh, restrictions for humans. But for any other Xeno residents of UNS, they can pretty much, uh, you know, uh, immigrate or uh, immigrate outside or immigrate inside UNS. Okay. Construction complete. Right.
speaking of which, I have forgotten my UNS Navy here. My Fort UNS should be... Okay. And, uh... I don't know, let's recruit some guy here. However, Zi Hao... Yeah, I'll probably recruit an Admiral here. Wait, wait. Sota Nakagawa, but she's already 71. We don't want to waste some resources on some... Uh... How about Mold Lockhart? Sounds like a good girl. So we'll just... Uh... You know, put her on the fort... Uh, the helm on the fort UNS. Okay, foreign next security... Uh... Hmm, okay, we got the foreign next security. This is a private military company. Um... Oh, holy guacamole, what's this? Oh my god. You know, I was just mentioning a while ago that there is no galactic crisis. And now, I am, uh, you know, uh, we do have a galactic crisis now. And I don't know how am I going to handle this one, to be honest. Instruments come across the United Nations have suddenly picked up a sub saharan power surge of massive proportions coming from somewhere within our galaxy. Uh-oh, that's not a very good sign. Could this be... Well, I'm gonna write this down as a uh, uh, story-wise because of the, uh, um, you know, experimentations of the UNS on the jump drives and UN and inverse mass map, inverse uh, dark matter or something. It has led to a power surge. Nothing like... The exact of your point is suddenly power surge has yet to be identified. Oh my god, we better get our forces ready because this Practice is spaceborne life form. Oh shh. Make some system is ready. Okay, so this is gonna be a big problem. However, the question is how large is this? Or what kind of a spaceborne life form this is? Uh, it's somewhere within the galaxy, but which part of the galaxy? Okay, uh, hopefully this is not gonna be uh, some sort of uh, electronic boogaloo or something as what they call it. But, we should be prepared. The best, you know as they say, the best defense is actually the best offense. Uh, you in his fleet. Oh, great, everybody's at full strength. Uh, UNS, okay. Alright, I just am not very good with this one. Um, so we're, our fleets are just only 60 and uh, something. So we have to uh, boost our production of some sort. Oh god, I'm, uh, I don't feel so good about this to be honest. Uh, it, this could be a big problem. Um, okay, uh, how about we made a ninth... Uh, uh, the UNS 9th uh, fleet which is mostly uh, um, okay it's only conver uh, composed of corvettes and frigates this is the UNS 9th fleet we gotta have these little uh, folks here just to be ready okay so I guess that's more than enough and hopefully, uh, the UNS wins with this one. Uh, ship designer. Um, okay, we're just gonna go uh, auto uh, clear design and then auto compete. Okay, that should give us some. Uh, wait. No, it's gonna be have to be uh, uh, you know, tracking thing. What's this? Disengagement community. Tracking. Uh, disengagement. No, we're not. I think we go for afterburners with this one. Evasion will have to be uh, our priority for this fleet. So, uh, for interceptors, we got to have this one. It's a mix of... Uh, okay. Whew. Sorry, I have to make some preparations here because I know it's already, uh, you know, uh, end of times, uh, or what do you call this? Yeah, okay. 
evasion okay we should go clear design and well, wait what, what happens this all right and auto complete ship okay and uh, we're gonna add some afterburners because we need that um, wait this is not an interceptor wait why do I have an interceptor here this is not supposed to be an interceptor this is oh okay it's only interceptor and picket ship okay so it's just separated with uh, oh god okay okay uh, this is uh, a bit of a uh, uh, ship roll how about the gunship Oh, screen ships, we got this one. Okay. Uh, um, we're just gonna head on afterburners. Okay, save. Okay, so this one, uh, ship roll, will probably be... Um, uh, brawler, I guess. Um, right, clear design, auto compete. Oh god, well, at least we got some quantum missiles here. Yeah, okay, uh, we'll just go save this. G um, it's always equipped with an afterburners. Okay, there we go, let's just hope for the best. Stingray, picket ship, interceptor, interceptor, picket ship. So we have two, we supposed to we have two interceptors and two picket ships. Okay, we're good with that. For the frigate, yeah, we have the bomber type. Um, I'm gonna go with this one, um, ship roll. Okay, we have clear design, auto compete rolls. Uh, okay. Uh, we could just go with this. I think we go for crystal pleading. And this one's supposed to be, since it's a bomber type, it's supposed to be uh, tracking stuff. I think we'll go with decoder here, just to uh, give this a little bit of a firepower. Explosive weapons, torpedo tactics, that's good. Okay, we'll just uh, save this one. Uh, the, the Makihara class. Okay, now fleet manager, we're going to compose this one. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. Okay, I'm just going to sell a little bit of these, just to, um, and a little bit of these, and probably some gases, and then buy this one. So, um, fleet manager wise, there we go. We got a whole set of them. So, okay, let's continue. We got the Ninth Fleet ready. Uh, hopefully, this will be a good... Uh, oh, where the hell is this? Rixum. Okay, I have no idea where Rixum is. Oh, Occupated Remnant Zone. Okay, we're not gonna go with this. Um, we'll just... Uh, Dismantle this, and dismantle this. And uh, we're just gonna replace this one with, um, I don't know, maybe... Mm, where's the Rixim? We're just gonna replace this one with... Uh, okay, and... Uh, just gonna convert it into an anchorage. Uh, Naval Logistics Office. Yeah, okay, I guess that's it. We just have to need more boost here for our naval capacity. Hopefully, uh, we be the UNS is ready here. So I still have to think about the story on how this, uh, you know, kind of, you know, uh, interconnects. So, uh, for now, uh, Okay. Okay, thank you. Okay, so I can't really see what is that uh, sudden surge of uh, 
there's no uh, you know identification so I guess that's not a need of concern right now but we will keep in touch <laughs> Mm. Oh god, they are coming. So on 2376, 25 years earlier than 2400, uh, these guys have shown up. And uh, Obvious Abyss. Oh my god, the Mitfell. The Mitfell is going to be, uh, it's right near beside this one. 700,276 Okay, we gotta... Okay, so this is a bit of a problem, so uh, we probably have to assemble the border. So the first... Uh, we got the racket fleet here. The Abyss. Uh, the source of a massive power source detected earlier has been identified. It comes from some kind of gigantic tear in the dubious uh, abyss system fleets arranged spacecraft are pouring out of dimensional portal in earliest peaks of this grid attacks against everyone into contact with them we have intercepted a powerful signal being sent from giving the vessel somewhere on the other side of sounds like a hunting call yeah point of mentor and dimensional rep. okay interceptor transmission feeding ground reach pray bountiful at long last we shall feast Okay, better get ready. Uh, actually, the uh, the nearest here would probably be this uh, Uri remnants. Uh, huh. So, how large are these guys? We got two hundred thousand, two hundred thousand, seven hundred thousand. Uh, for now, it's best uh, we rendezvous our full fleet right now. We have to. Uh, you know, call the Union fleet as well in this area. Uh, well, for now, the nearest danger zone is this area. Now, they're not gonna go here, so they probably have to expand there. So, okay. Oh, what the hell? Can you believe this? This is how stupid the computer is. Oh, okay, so they just went through the nearest warp gate around. Huh. Okay, the UNS third fleet. I hope they're... Um okay, we're gonna upgrade most of our... Uh oh, Dragon Spearhead. Okay, our boys are here. Okay, uh, Void Spawns. Six UNS fleet. The six UNS fleet have to be upgraded, unfortunately. Second is the same thing. Um, first UNS also had to be updated. Uh, fourth UNS fleets, I'm not sure if they're battle ready yet, unfortunately. Most of these guys. Okay, so we got only a few forces available here. So for now, uh, the only thing we could do is probably summon our, um, our, uh, Mercenary groups, unfortunately. Are they welcome? We wish to rent a fleet. Oh, jeez. To hire a mercenary. Uh, 14,000. Okay, we'll, we'll see if we have some budget for that. Got an additional food, maybe they could... Uh, okay, goodbye. Okay, and our... Um, Okay, the fortress initiative is more than enough to do that whole rumbling thing. Okay, uh, I guess they're very good at it. The Griffin Company. Okay, uh, we need 10,000 uh, cash. Um, okay, we'll see what we can do here. So, we are going to go for an emergency fund. The Griffin Company. Goodbye. Okay, Griffin Company, your main mission here is to pull this one. You know. Okay. Um, okay. Um, well, we already got the employee of the. Uh, so we got one. We got two, and we got three. Okay, we should have an extra one, two, three, four. 
Oh yeah, we wish to rent a fleet. Um, okay, thirteen thousand. Well, um, except uh, credit cards or something. Okay, uh, I guess not. Okay, uh, right. Okay, well, we got a lot of folks here. Uh, yeah, it's a deal. Goodbye. Uh, right. Alright, so we're going to send the Crimson Company all of our private military contractors to test the defenses of the so-called, uh, uh, so-called dubious abyss. Um, for now, what I can say is that this is the result of the experiments of the... Oh, okay, it's already 30 minutes. So I'm going to, uh, save this one first. This will be, um... Okay, this will be UNS episode 19A. There we go, and I am going to save this one on our OBS. So just give me a second here. Okay, welcome back. So we just uh, saved that as a precaution. So uh, yeah, so we should continue. So for now, um, oh, of course I've already, I think I've already set the gameplay here to uh, at least all Galactic Crisis if I recall correct. So that uh, if I'm not satisfied with the first Galactic Crisis, we can go on with the second story of uh, a second crisis. Just of course for story wise. So hopefully we, oh, holy guacamole, there were not 200,000, they were 2.9 million. <laughs> This is really, really problematic. Ugh, great, great, great. This is not good. Hopefully, uh, I hope that uh, the uh, unbidden fleet here, uh, you know, unbidden fleet here just, uh, well, they're not doing anything. Field engineers have cleared a blocker. So, okay. Um, okay, we better ask our science guys here. Um, okay, I'm just gonna have a meeting. Um, well, we got our... Okay, can we talk with these guys? Uh, Black uh, Mercenary. Okay, they are not exactly available. Or uh, are they? Oh! Oh, we got some, uh... Okay, so we got a little bit of an economy here. We need to fire 24,000. Are they available? Yeah, okay. So we could field one of the largest, uh... Um, I don't know, fleets. Okay, it's a deal. Hey, uh, we're just gonna rent you for a while because this is gonna be a whole nasty stuff. Hope you could, uh, you know, what, 48,000? Black Tower Initiative Fleet, that's not exactly convincing. How about uh, Crimson Company? Yeah, we already got that. Well, that's the curator. Um, what the hell? Okay, uh, Mysteries of this Universe. Okay, so they're, uh... Okay, uh, right. Okay, well, for now. Oh god, two million. How the hell would I... Well, how the hell would I even... Okay, I'll just have to... Well, we got the Dragon Spearhead, we got the Fortress Initiative, we got the Griffin Company, um, Hydra Spearhead, Diplomacy, how, uh, okay, they're currently renting that, okay, Midfile Security, okay, well, as long as they're not, uh, Uri Remnant doesn't like us, the Valor Canny, they're xenophobic. Corporate uh Yumasara. Okay, so we're just going to 
uh, ask as well uh, this is an emergency session uh, I hope our guys here would be more than happy regarding the uh, galactic uh, the unbidden it will cost us empire 100 to propose this one. shall we add the proposal queue yes add that proposed queue uh, oh, okay good um, emergency measures okay so hopefully um, they could uh, you know add some focus with this one because this is a serious issue and I hope okay we got 2,000 uh, so far they're kind of um, well they're kind of isolated with this one so uh, which is a good uh, good thing for me uh-huh how okay so this is uh, kind of confusing how the hell I ended up with the um, how do I ended up with the 3,000 uh, fleets here? This is quite some stupid uh, thing. Oh, okay, I guess because of the negative plus 73 percent. Uh huh, new branch. Okay, uh, right, okay, I guess that's a uh, bit of explains it. Okay, so uh, they're pouring out three million now. This is not very good. Uh huh. Griffin private security here as well. Hmm. Okay, we got at least uh, a lot of them. Uh, we're only doing here, but. Not sure why I have uh, alloys is now reduced to uh, plus five. This is not very good in my case. It's more like bankruptcy for me. Okay. Hmm. Right. Uh, huh? We got now four of them. Oh, this is a problem. Okay. Construction complete. Right. UNS ninth fleet. Okay, this is going to be the ninth UNS fleet. UNS fleet hopefully um, yeah okay so I guess I'm over capacity right now uh, it's okay um, yeah I'll go for Admiral Sun Gab here seems to be the only qualified guy right now and now I'm zero definitely my uh, hmm. Yeah, I'll just push my uh, fleet here. Great. I really hate. It. I'm not sure why my economy just, uh, you know, took out damn nosedive here. I don't think that's very much fair right now on my. Uh, yeah, we're just gonna hit him with all we got right now with the foreign X union. What's this? Dragons. Uh, Six UNS fleet will also have to go there. Second UNS fleet. Uh, first UNS fleet. What's the river doing here? Okay, just I don't know. Okay, Warnak security. Yeah, I really hate it when my economy just sn snow dives like that. Racket private security, who cares? Okay, let's go. Let's uh, see how this uh, 
So we got three fleets here that are currently, uh, well. Okay, so how long this will uh, last, we don't know. For now, we're just gonna pour all our mineral productions right now. Um, and some zero, I guess. Okay. It should be more than enough. Um, okay, the M. Biden arrives. Uh, probably this is because the result of the uh, UNS experimentation on the inverse mat inverse dark matter and the uh, you know jump drive technology. But uh, like I said, let's see how this fight goes. We got the Foreign Axe Union fleet. We got the Griffin Company, and. Uh, mm -hmm. Um, I don't know for the Senate floor here. What's this personal oversight? Ethics attraction towards the overlords fanatic. Independent diplomacy is no longer valid as a term agreements. Holding three is no longer valid as a term. I'm not gonna go with this one. Focus on the unbinding. I support this obviously. Oh god, they've already started attacking. And uh, they're gonna attack full force here. This one is 2 million, so that's a good uh, good thing here. Okay, hmm. uh, right. God, this is gonna be a very problem. <clears throat> So the Midfell was the first one uh, to be attacked. Unfortunately, the Midfell is the um, primary ally of the Fornax Union. So, uh, well, as like any other, you know, uh, uh, we can't let uh, the Midfell, uh, the allies, or one of the founders or the tenants of the Fornax Union, to be fall under this extra-dimensional uh, invader. Mm -hmm. Uh, for now, I'm already uh, having a sky dunk here on this economy. Okay, just give me a moment. I'll uh, see what I can do with my uh, 30k here. Um, edicts. Uh, we're gonna go for... Um, oh, we gotta go with the... Uh, uh, I don't have alloy subsidies. This is really funny. A grand fleet and uh, we can the ship upkeep all the yeah I can I guess we could uh, grand fleet well power we don't need much influence right now so uh, scientific revolution will be put on hold uh, to draw Renaissance entire build speed plus 100. Hearts and minds, yeah. Grand fleet that should, uh, you know, reduce our upkeep. Oh God. Uh. All right. Um. Okay. Uh. Okay, so I guess uh, at least that should help, at least for the edicts part. Fleet supremacy, ship upkeep, no build speed, we're not building anything, we just have to reduce the upkeep here. Uh, we'll go for terraforming gases, we might need that. So that they could, uh, you know, and blocker clearance. Sensor range, yeah, I think we could need this one. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Alright, so, uh, yeah, I guess we'll see how it does. For the moment, the attacks here on the Mitfell are uh, currently, uh, 
so we got tons of uh, 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 okay um, okay for now we're just uh, more like rallying our troops here um, so we're gonna hit them hard here uh, for us, it's a good thing that this one is... Oh, okay, they kind of leave it open. Okay, let's see uh, how that will work. So they kind of leave it up open. That, that, that's why, that wasn't pretty smart of it. Dubious Abyss, Barren World, um, it fell in Lightning Kingdom. Yeah, I know. How does this... Hit points, extra dimensional invader, I don't know, this is at least one million or something. Okay, do me some this. Okay, so we're gonna hit him hard. Problem is uh Okay, it reduced now to at least one thousand, so uh, okay we can live with that. And we got now four hundred uh or the ship upkeeps. Um, okay, let me guess with my uh, societal management here. Um, trust gap, embassy plus three unity. Uh, okay, uh, ethics attraction negative. Okay, life spent was 20 years, edic funds, stability. Okay, uh, Governor Koichi Maguchi just got himself killed. Um, or got diseased uh -huh. physics society yeah we need that try to research as much as possible okay the Kalsan Republic has also pledged its secret fealty it's a good thing that the uh, extra dimensional isn't really that smart right now and they're only limited to one two three five fleets right now so uh, I guess we can handle this at least uh, from what it looks like okay so we're gonna be a bit negative on the unity points because we're now negative 370 uh, New Taiwan is not operational yet from the looks of this and uh, oh god uh, okay uh, let me check my edicts here Desperate measures. Uh, what's this? House territory fire defensive. Uh huh. Okay. Um, we have over budgeted and over strained our uh, our uh, oh. Bureau of Espionage. Fortify the border. Okay. So we're now gonna go for a decisive uh, decapitating strike, whatever you call that little uh, thingy here. Unfortunately, most of my fleets are, for some reason, um, not. Um, I don't know. Okay, let me check my uh, fleet here. God, this is very. Uh, Ah, uh, problematic for me right now. Hmm. Okay, I got some several fleets here that are not doing their thing. Okay, um, the void spawn would have a. Huh. Okay. Okay. Right. So uh, the unbidden arrives here. Uh huh. Two seven. This one's three million. This one's two million. Okay, so it's a good thing that they just only have five fleets right now. But that's still a lot. And then the mid fell. Uh, form research. Uh, yeah, form research agreement. I think we kind of need that right now. Okay. Alright, uh, we're just gonna call every uh, folks here on our. Uh oh, damn it! Okay, uh, right. 
Okay, birdies, come here. Come on, come on, come on. Let's have a little chat. Okay, we're just gonna go visit this, guys. We form a research agreement. Okay, we got that first guy. Um, how about the new cow? Our sub sub vassals. Um, how about Holy Terrassian? Some guys. Okay, we already got a research agreement with the, with them. Commodore Fikiti, yeah, we'll form a research agreement with you. I'm gonna have to share that little uh, stuff that we need. Okay, we already got that. Um, how about Star Nation of Piketty? Yes, we need all your research. We have to pull all our uh, resources here. Sovereign State of Urban Knights. Yes, we're gonna go for uh, uh, how the Uri Republic. Yes, you might be dead by the next uh, few months. The Uri Commonwealth is also the same t thing. This is gonna be a collaborative, uh... Well, they're loyal, and we're all gonna open our borders to you, okay? So, okay. Uh, we, we don't know the interstate state, but, uh, yeah, okay. We're a totalitarian regime, but in the face of galactic crisis, there is no such thing as that. Okay, this one's, uh... And why are my fleets really slow right now? The Griffin Company... Yeah, we're gonna poke them in the eye and see how it goes. Have James Cook... And, uh, I don't know... Um... Actually, the main fighting force of this one should be frigates. But uh, I just want to reduce all the mercenary cost right now. Uh, we'll go first with all the mercenaries and then follow by the, uh, you know. Okay, so they're heading south uh, from the looks of it. So uh, this is going to be a very, very uh, long fight. Laws, we don't know about the laws right now. Okay. Inbound message traffic. Yes, yes. Yes, we're gonna establish an embassy. We need this just to accelerate a few researches there. A uh, few researches. So, uh, this is gonna be a very, very busy uh, recorded Let's Play. Oof. Uh, from the looks of it, they are spreading fast. <laughs> okay, the Uri Commonwealth has agreed to share technology as well on this threat. So it'll be, uh, I don't know. Well, the artisan troops are, uh, yeah, it's a deal. Uh, it's a deal. We need to save all the. Okay, well met. Okay, so uh, let's hope that the uh, Inbidden here got itself spread. Uh, no. Okay, we got a little bit negative unity here, but we can still hold that out. Alright, so the 6th Fleet has the first to arrive here. Um, okay, we're gonna poke this guy in the uh, butt and see how, uh, how it works. A new world has been secured for our colonists. Shilak, okay, New Thailand. New Thailand is... Um, okay, uh, this guy is... Okay. Uh, they're uh, far north, so uh, we're gonna, you know, dedicate them to an industrial world. Or, an, yeah, industrial world. Uh, so it's both... Uh, uh, we're gonna, yeah, uh, we're gonna build five first of this, two, three, four, five, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, uh, we're gonna build, K 
Okay, uh, hello feeders and then police force. Okay, well we can build trade later on. Um, add luxuries here, so we could, uh, oh wait, my mistake, uh, not stronghold, uh, we're gonna add the robotics thing. Robotics will come first. Um, this is of course to aid the humans uh, rega in regards to the battle of the, uh, you know, in regards to the battle of uh, the Unbidden. So yeah. Okay, so this is going to be a very, very, you know, Caesar is... We're gonna offer some immigration treaties with you so we could, uh, you know, in case save some Mitfell uh, populations, the government who wants to go in exile, they can go in exile in the UNS. Since they are the number one or one of the key founders of the Fornax Union. <laughs> okay. Okay, this is gonna be a yeah, a large uh a large fleet action. Finance security company, yeah, okay. Hmm. Oh sorry, it's uh still pause. So uh <laughs> Okay, there we go. Okay, uh, let me check. What's planetary build speed? Well, I should have some sort of planetary... Uh, Let's go. Let's just continue this. Okay, hmm. we got a whole. Uh okay, this is going to be a very, very uh, long fight. Okay, so uh, story-wise, I just have to, uh, oh, great, I think I have to, oh, great, I, uh, so I'm just gonna put it here on this uh, map, yeah, I think this would be, uh, you know, a very good uh, way to put it on the map, <laughs> great, my fleets are, uh, uh, currently assembling here. So how many do we got? Uh, we are not sure. But for now, uh, this one's alone, so it's a good target. I mean, strategically at least, this one should uh, be uh, what do you call this? Uh, be a good target for a uh, UNS because uh, this one is um, all alone. Oh God, it's moved. No, 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 no. Okay, stop, stop, stop. Should go here. Okay, that should, uh, what's this? Okay, let's check this one. Excellent. Okay, I have no idea what this, um... Archaeologists are preparing to leave as they have been thrown a large alien chamber of cardio artifacts in the slobber. They use a royal nose web. Uh, set the rubricator or make a round turn. Okay, so they've already made a discovery of a replicator which is used for the uh, artifacts. Very good. 
Um, reverse engineer arcane technology. Okay, excellent. And uh, I don't know. We we resell with diversity now. Preparing to leave, and they happened upon a large healing chair. Four-legged table with carving face. They confirm a funny set of rooms here. Tiny set. Okay, so we didn't get the rubricator here. They've already excavated, but no rubricator. Okay. So okay, that kind of okay, that's kind of a bit of a disappointment, but uh, okay, uh, we're okay with that. Uh, yeah. Yeah, they're just heading off here. So we'll probably have to meet them here. Um, okay, we'll just have to wait here, I guess. Now I am. Oh! Taking evasive action. Okay, okay. So we got some problems here. Uh, a snarling hissing fiend appeared out of the void. Translate here. Mm. Our colonists in New Taiwan are in great New danger. sit rep. New sit rep. Talents of the void. Okay, um... Yeah, okay, this is... New sit rep. Oh god, okay, fine. Skywalk has sighted a space for life form. Give back the Rubicator this instant. Uh -huh. Okay, so I guess my uh, gameplay here is having some. Uh, New sit wrap. Okay, uh, we got a new four fifth UNS fleet have to be redirected here. And the fourth UNS fleet have to also uh, be redirected. Along with the, uh, I don't know, any near military forces here. Uh, God, we're in currently in the middle of a, one of the largest wars here. Uh, second UNS will have to, uh, yeah, attack with this. Tenth UNS and second UNS fleet will have to, uh, yeah, have to be redirected here, I guess. So what we have right now here is the third, anything that is uh, larger than a hundred thousand. So we have to commit those. Okay, our uh, Taiwan here uh, is currently being uh, attacked, I guess. Unfortunately, I have to... Uh God, I really hate this one. Imagine has to go through round out this round. Okay, so uh, yeah, we just have to uh, redirect the uh, dragon spirit, unfortunately, because the AI is too dumb. Anyway, I've uh, have to save this one. Um, this will be UNS episode 19, letter B. So we're going to. Uh, save this one on our OBS so uh, I'm a bit overextended now on the time which I didn't notice okay and we'll take a short break 
Hello everyone and welcome back after that short break that we had so let's continue on our recorded let's play here so uh, currently we are now in the endgame crisis which appeared 25 years earlier and uh, thankfully uh, we only got a few uh, extra dimensional uh, fleets uh, running amok here most of our fleets have already assembled in the EPR system uh, right in the um, the Uri Commonwealth so at the moment, our uh, main problem right now here is that the uh, uh, the unbidden here, as what they call themselves, is uh, currently destroying the uh, the Midfell Enlightened Kingdom, one of the uh, main uh, what do you call this? Oh, I got a lot of shroud here. Great dragon. Okay, so this is funny, because there's some errors, I got now several dragons appearing up here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Not a very good thing. Huh. Okay, well, uh, I hope we get some rewards up there. Up there. Uh, okay, uh, we go for... Private military combat drugs? No. Harmonic isolation shield damage. Armor damage. Okay, we'll go for armor damage. And we can celebrate diversity, but uh, they wouldn't let us. Okay, it will take them 81 days, so that will take a lot of time. In the meantime, we're being attacked by 8 dragons here. And I didn't like it, so... Okay, so we can uh, combat deploy the army, local kaiju here, but uh, hmm. uh, first fleet. Where, where's this first fleet? I have no idea. Uh, I could go for my local kaiju here. Hmm. Yeah, they're just uh, probably on the border guards, just in case worse things worse things happen. Okay, we got all the fleets. We need to attack this one. Okay, we got two battleships. Right, uh, the first one we'll attack will be the 5th UNS fleet, accompanied by this one. So, yeah. And we got the 4 next Union fleet. Unfortunately, they're not... Uh, huh. I don't know. Okay, uh, uh, this is quite dangerous because they're uh, now on the border system here. Uh, do we have some sort of disruptors for uh, hyperlane register, collection radar, uh, aura? This, yeah, we, we could get get that one. Yeah, Igarian Arbitrators, the Awakened Ascendancy, they even cooperated. For some reason, they are. Huh. They've opened their, uh, they're the first ones to recognize the threat, which is kind of funny. Mm -hmm. The rest of the galaxy is just ignoring it, unfortunately. Mm -hmm. huh. Senate floor, um, are they still voting with this? Yes, they will still have to vote this for the next year, unfortunately. <laughs> Do they have some sort of jump drive? Ah, great. Okay, we got a few hundred uh, fleets here. It's not a hundred thousand fleet, but uh, okay. Let me let me make a roll call here. Okay, the fort uh, 
the fourth UNS fleet is now engaged with this one. So, uh, the fourth and the, uh, Wait, 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 just give me a moment. Okay, let's uh, go get some... Uh, let's go get some videos over this one. Okay, unfortunately we've released several uh, dragons in the process. Eight of them. By error. Gameplay error. Well, anyway, it's already recorded. Uh, it's a game error. Yeah, I'll just have to tuck this away for good video. Uh, you know, good videos. Oh god. Well, that is annoying. Yeah, send in the necromancers. Relic found. We'll divide them for an opportunity. Yeah. Need a sit wrap. Yeah, we'll uh, send in the. Uh, we'll have that uh, reused and fight uh, alongside uh, the uh, UNS uh, Corvette Company fleet. Okay. Okay, we're gonna have some battle cry here. <laughs> so they're still busy uh, smacking this uh, shrad thing, the battle of our new Taiwan. Okay, so that's the new battle. So I'm just gonna write it, uh, I think, story wise, that they released several dragons. And the battle for New Taiwan has started. Okay, so this is a good... Uh, yeah, I'll just better keep this one unrecorded, at least for 30 seconds or something. Okay, we're gonna need those dragons and at least to, uh, you know, throw them against the Unbidden. Okay, so, uh, yeah, uh, I think the UNS can handle most of that. The 4th and 5th fleet, they're kind of busy right now. Oh, shit. Okay, sorry. My words, bad words. <laughs> so the bad part here is that we don't most have uh, battleships in our uh, fleet there. But, uh... Okay, so I guess everybody's assembled here except for the, uh... For the Dragon Spear, which is... will take at least... 580, uh, I don't know, 580 days or something. So we got eight. Okay, so we got now eight fleets. Uh, fleet number two would be the weakest. So, uh, yeah, could we attack this one? Yeah, I guess we do have uh, some. Uh, no, I, I want to max. I want to maximize as much as possible here. Are they? Uh, Okay, just gonna go with this. Hope our corvette fleets will. Uh, Science division reports a new breakthrough. Okay, good. Research speed. Yeah, we we're gonna need all that research speed that we could. Um, Sapient combat AI. Yeah, but uh, I don't think that they will gonna be revolt right now. It's too far now for the mid game crisis. <laughs> Uh, rash 81,074, 700, yeah, that's not even roughly translates to a million. Yeah, we need this, guys. Encourage it. Uh, new Singapore, yeah, encourage it. So far, uh, they've harvested 12 vessels, so that's not much. 
the demise or send in the necromancer. Need a sit wrap. Yes, the UNS fleet here, or half of the UNS fleet, are busy uh, kicking this one. Construction complete. Okay. Mm -hmm. So they're now battling uh, this uh, thing. and the uh, kingdom is being decapitated hmm. and my lazy uh, mercenaries here okay let's just take our time here uh, hmm. okay uh, we'll probably have to go here all of our fleets now have to move so we're gonna pick up the smallest ones first what the hell this one just jumped out of nowhere I guess the unbinding also has the ability to jump here New sit rep. yeah yeah of course okay we're still uh one two three four five so they're kind of busy uh, you know taking this one God, where's my uh, necromancers when you need them? Well, it's not exactly necromancers, more like scientists. Oh god, the cal galaxy. Science division reports a new breakthrough. Okay, okay, yeah. Uh, when, okay, it's uh, food, star based construction. Ah, oh, god. What do we got? What do we gotta do with this one? Upkeep from 20 jobs and then uh, resources is plus 20. Yeah, I guess we gotta go with that. New Spain here has some issues. But, uh. <laughs> okay, we're currently now, uh. <laughs> okay, Whew. this is gonna be a very tense battle. And my UNS here, fleet, is uh, uh, kind of busy as well. Yes, yes, I need the Necromancers. So we're down to four. Okay. Whew, this is going to be an action packed. Uh, okay, we're going to move out our full uh, fleet here. Point X Union fleets. Uh. Oh God! Why is some of my fleets here not in aggressive mode? Okay. Um. It's a deal. Goodbye. Well met. Uh, right, New Taiwan is uh, just gonna make some decisions here. Our work exhibit, we kind of need you. <laughs> All right, uh, I guess everyone should be aggressive here. The Griffin Company should be sent. Um, Crimson Company is also. Uh, Okay, we got a million strong now. Um, yes, uh, okay, uh, how do I... Uh, hmm. Yeah, of course. Send in the micro. Okay, we're now down to three of them, so that's good. Oh, great, 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 great. What's this? Citron Manifold is also now opening their borders. They are now recognizing the threat. Uh, 
Okay, well, we got some dumb scientists here. Okay, I'm just gonna send several of my scientists. Uh, okay, uh, since he's doing nothing, I don't have to put him. Uh, okay, just uh, insert some system here. And his Hernhart is. Uh, how about Hawking? Uh, Hawkins uh, kind of near. Okay, Hawkins, do your stuff. Uh, don't be shy about that. James Cook is. Uh, yeah. Okay. Uh, this guy. Um, I'll have to. Uh, I don't know. Send this guy. Yes. Let's send him there. Okay. Let's continue because this is going to be a hectic. Uh, Right, let's start this one. Well, the system is resistor. Okay, fine. Damn it. I really hate it because my, uh. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, take him 500 days because they're too damn stupid. Uh, okay, we're, we're just gonna go. <laughs> I just go check the system and uh, destroy this one. Remember, we're here to engage. Weapons free. Weapons free. Okay. Uh. Okay, weapons free. We're gonna attack this one. Well, make sure that our edicts here. I think so the next one. Yeah. Farming subsidies. <laughs> Equipment company. Okay, so we got several uh, private securities here along with the, uh, you know, I don't know. You folks, maybe. Oh, 500,000. This is going to be a, a little bit of a battle, I guess. <laughs> New yeah. Okay. Okay, we got this. Um, this is gonna be. Um, I don't know. Maybe uh, a Tokyon monument in Senegal. Yeah. Okay. Okay, let's uh Okay, um let's just go sell some food I guess. <laughs> see our uh fighting skills here and uh see if we could uh move here. Hopefully our uh Dragon Spearhead Company would be, uh, you know, good enough to, uh, you know, provide support with this one. 100, 300, 500,000, uh, 700,000. Okay. Okay, so are all of our UNS fleets here? Huh, probably go here. Okay, <laughs> uh, this is gonna be a very, very hectic uh, battle. 12 days, 17 days, there will be combat uh, active actions. <sighs> Alright, so uh, they're already headed for the hyper relay. Okay. Let's see how this works. Yeah, Foreign Act Security Company. Yeah, they're the first ones to step. Huh, what says Black Tower Initiative returns? I don't know what happened with these guys. Mm -hmm. 
Engaging enemy station. Okay, that's good. So we have the whole might of the uh, Fornax Union fleet here. Um, yeah, okay. Okay, we got the whole might of our uh, fleet here. Uh, <clears throat> see how this uh, of course this will be a winning battle because this is just only a star base it's not the main fleet that we're kind of attacking right now so uh yeah the fighters and the mercenaries all of them are now uh you know uh, of course it's gonna be a battle uh got a small frigate fleet here doing all the stuff they could okay the 2.9 million fleet is headed their way for reinforcements okay um, slave market we'll probably go uh, I don't know we need new Taiwan to be specific uh, New Taiwan. Um, okay, uh, New France, New Colony, Madagascar. Yeah, okay. Okay, we're just going to sell uh, most of our uh, minerals right now. Okay, that should be good. And uh Okay, bubbles. Wait, who's this one? Oh the dreadnought escort fleet. Okay, uh right, uh Okay, so probably have to, uh, you know, this is gonna be a big, uh, uh, I don't know, maybe a big sh uh, so we'll probably be constructing a few, uh, uh, corvettes, I guess. The Knight UNS fleet is a corvette, uh, fleet. Okay, they're moving southward against this one, uh, near to the center of the galaxy. Uh, we take, so uh, we're gonna win with this. Mm -hmm. Kinetic batteries. Uh, right. Okay, we got our. Uh, I guess we got our uh, whole mercenary fleet here covered. Problem is this fleet here, which is already headed their way. Uh huh. This is going to be a big issue for the UNS. Yeah, the night UNS fleet. Oh. Okay, what do we got? Uh, okay, we won. Okay, with seven. Uh, so so uh, we're going to buy some time here. They could reverse engineer this. And here we're gonna fight our, our way out. Uh, I mean, we're gonna fight this one just to uh, see complete. how uh, how uh, you know. We want to see how this uh, uh, you know. We want to see how the combat uh, works out. Of course, they're already entering here. Okay. 
Wait, wait, wait. We go here. Go in distance. <laughs> Crimson Company here. <laughs> so this is gonna be uh, more like a tag uh, cat and mouse gameplay right now. Okay, what we need is the James Cook to uh, at least reverse engineer it. Buy it some time, reverse engineer the uh, whole uh, engine, the whole uh, how this uh, unbinding works. How their fleet, uh, you know, operates. So we need them to be reverse engineered. Okay, so this is now it. The whole bow thing. Oh, who died? Scientist Anna of UNSS is hawking. Okay, that was really uh, anti uh, killing. Okay, where is this little guy? Uh, right okay just do the reverse engineering or something fleet action underway okay so this is the first main battle the battle of brahman uh brahman uh, i don't know the first wheel of battle for the uns and its mercenary fleet okay and this will determine and see if uh how how the owl? Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, right. Uh, F9. Okay. We'll now see how uh, this. Uh, you know how this battle ends up. Okay, I'm just doing this just for uh, you know. I'm just doing this for uh, cinematic purposes, of course. So we're now launching our. Uh, yeah, okay, we're going a little bit up. This is the first battle between the Unbinded and the UNS forces and the Fornax Union fleet. So it's a total combined fleet uh, action here. So hopefully we got enough, uh, uh, I don't know, enough, uh, enough fi firepower to at least repel them. Of course, this is almost 2.9 million fleet uh, power, so I expect that there will be uh, heavy casualties in this one. So I just need a footage here. Okay. Oh god, as you can see, it's already a massacre here. But we don't have any choice. We need to stop them, and we need uh, this, uh, you know, this is a galactic crisis level event. Unfortunately, it kind of sours the mood that we have some skippy, uh... Okay, what the hell? Not this time. What the hell? Dragon Spearhead Company just bailed out in the middle of fracking. Let me just give me a moment here because that's really oh magenta the midfowl. Uh It's a deal. I really hate that when somebody bails out. Now where is my damn fleet? You're not gonna bail out again, I just rented you for a few... Uh, God, I really hate that. Okay, so how are... Oh, oh my god! There were two? How the hell did that happen? Admiral Fetters of Ebony, GSC Penguin was uh, killed. We're not gonna Science win. Ship lost with all hands. Yes, of course. Eunice James Cook was also destroyed. 
Uh, third Uranus fleet. Six Uranus fleet have to retreat. Uh, let the mercenary fleets uh, have a. Uh, Fortress Initiative fleet is okay. Third Uranus fleet have to uh, bail out with this one. Because they're. Uh, I think that was not a fair fight because, uh, you know, one just suddenly appeared out of nowhere. Okay, so we'll just let uh, all of the, uh, you know, but this is a losing fight. I do uh, agree with this one. Four million. We can't stand a, a, a fleet power four million with that kind of thing. So they just have to, uh, uh, I don't know, maybe. So uh, Uranus Hawking was killed. Uh, okay, so Hawking was the first, and James Cook was also destroyed. What the hell happened with that? Oh, the scientist. Okay, sorry. Of course, it's a losing fight. Can we order our uh, mercenary fleets here to retreat? Mm, we could order them for a retreat, I guess. Yeah, order them with a full tactical retreat. Can't uh, really, uh, you know, fight them right now. Because it's not a very good fight, because I was not expecting that it will be two against one. That's kind of a bit of unfair. Okay, <laughs> so we're just gonna attack this one. Uh, 200,000 is a... Uh, okay, so we're just... Uh, okay, this is kind of disappointing. And uh, the laws here are on the uh, repeal buzzword. Yeah, okay, we, we don't really have to do that. Our resolution or Senate floor. Uh, what the hell? Uh, this is not gonna. Uh, this is not gonna go for a win-win solution for me. So we got a three million fleet. Hmm. Okay, I'm uh, just gonna have to uh, assemble at least uh, most of my uh, forces here. Oh god! Yeah, most of my uh, yeah, they just reinforced it, but they're a uh, raid class. They're probably uh, very heavy. Huh. Okay, so we lost two. Uh, we'll, we'll probably have to uh, make a new science vessel out of that incident. We didn't get anything. So our uh, UNS fleet here is still intact, though. Problem is. Um, Okay, well, we're just gonna make our fleets here. Uh huh. Ah. Oh. Okay, uh, let me check this one. Clear design and auto completion ship. Yeah, this would be more. No, 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 no. Um, afterburners. Yep, save this one. Interceptors, okay. Okay, we got this one. Okay, we we'll probably have uh, that. Okay, so that's good. Um, we're gonna have uh, at least a whole uh, bunch of uh, Corvettes. So, uh, in the meantime, uh, we're gonna make a full Corvette fleet here. One. Uh, and ship design. Wait, um, Corvette class here. 
Corvette uh, GN Corvette 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 and Frigate so we got our uh, so hopefully we, this should be enough the only thing I need here is enough uh, what do you call it? Oh, oh my, uh, this is bad. Okay, I'm just gonna save this one. Uh, sorry, uh, this will be UNS uh, episode 19, letter C. Okay, so there we go. And I'm just gonna save this one on the OBS. Alright, so we're now on our final 30 minutes of our recorded Let's Play here. So uh, let's, uh, you know, let's get it on. So our fleet manager will probably have to construct new fleets that are entirely made of frigates. Um, oh. Um, uh, I mean frigates and corvettes. So that will be our uh, main... Uh, I don't know, maybe our main uh, stuff here. And... Uh, Okay, so we need a new uh Okay, so this is uh whew, okay. So let's continue. Uh so this is a main issue right now. We have to produce a whole Corvette fleet here. Black Tower Initiative is just, uh, uh I don't know. Uh, um, currently most of our fleets here have, uh, the Fornax Union fleet is totally destroyed as far as I'm concerned here. So, uh, yeah, I guess that's the thing. <laughs> Let me check on the federation here. Who's there? Okay, uh, yeah. Okay, so this is problematic right now. But we did destroy several bases here that are, uh, oh my god, we got a lot of them. Huh. Okay, what can you offer us? Uh, yeah. Okay, skill for design this. Okay, certainly did. Hmm, okay, so this is a very, very uh, problematic uh, battle right now that we have. However, we still got one mercenary fleet here that is... Uh, oh, it's just only one. So... Uh, yeah, the computer here is cheating most of the time. Um, why? Uh, from the looks of it, uh, you know, I got only one, and then uh, another, uh, another, uh, you know, another fleet just popped out of nowhere. Okay. Uh, okay, what do we got here? Okay. Um, yeah, we could use this one. Range. Okay. Um, fortunately, that's the thing. Well, at least we got some rubricators here. Negative 420 months remaining. Okay, that's not very good. Uh, let me check with the uh, edicts here. Uh, we got, supposedly we should have a uh, scientific revolution. We're just gonna have to cut this one out. We'll reduce the science rate, but we could sustain the, uh, you know, we could sustain the unity here. At least, uh, yeah, 26 months, 36 months, that's okay. We could live with that. Um,
that should give us uh, so at least some sort of positive uh, you know positive stuff Spaceport sensor. reports enemy contact scrape it or reduce the wall. this will reduce the amount of unity the shrine fled abolish over there oh god some pirates right now Okay, well, Zenaya, what's a Zenaya here? New Brazil. Oh, God. So, what's this? Pirate fleet. Okay, I have to sell. Uh... Okay, oh, great, it's so slow. Nah. Take a year. So, do I have any nearby military forces with that? No, I'm afraid so, no. Okay, there must be dealt with. Uh, sensor range, yes. Okay. Right. Um, so where's our uh, uh, Crimson Company? Is not doing good as well. What the hell just happened here? Okay, we'll just set them a, a rally point in the Rexum system, I guess. Not really like uh, this. Uh, uh, okay, the shore should be um, here. No, 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 okay. No, 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 my bad. The shore, the river. Um, Second fleet. Huh. Dark Abyss, second fleet, crest of uh, the coast. Alright, the cool. God, we got. And my menu here is now littered with all sorts of stuff. Okay, we're doing this fleet should be reinforced again with, uh, yeah, of course. No, 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 we're not, uh, okay, so we're, uh, yeah, okay, interceptor, we, uh, I, not sure where, where we get this one. Probably have to go for auto cannons and quantum missiles. And then, uh, yeah, okay. Okay, let's go. Whew, okay, so, uh, this is gonna be a big problem for me. Field engineers have cleared a blocker. Okay, yeah, good for me. In the meantime, I have to do a little bit of management. Um,. Okay, so we got, this is more like an error, but, uh, oh, Sanctuary. Okay, uh, what do we got here? Um, we we'll probably have to, uh, oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, this is my bad. Alright, let's check uh, the menu here. If we got the whole, uh, complete stuff here. Uh -huh. Okay, so this is a total crisis right now. Um, okay, uh, what do we got here? Um, should involve naval capacity, I guess. Uh, yeah, um... Recommenders reduce goods into a naval capacity. Okay, that's good. So for now, um, all right. So Yeah. 
in 1680 something like that Whew, that is really something uh, Pakistan is Senegal okay. I'll just check some stuff here um, Four, yeah, okay, how about the boundary? Okay, the boundary is also a forge world. Um, okay, well, I uh, got three unemployed jobs. This is not very good. Okay, uh, right. Assault. Well, wait, what's happening here? Why am I producing an assault robot assault fleet here? Okay, well, anyway. Not really into that kind of thing. Anyway, let's continue. Right, uh, for the moment, uh, I got some several. Oh god, they're attacking the Metfell space. Totally devastating it. Oof, and we're just only uh, uh okay what where's my mercenary fleets here um they should be okay racket private security is almost devastated as well oh uh, i guess the fornex union fleet has also been killed i guess that only explains it because I got some several uh, admirals here that were uh, killed. Hmm. Okay, so we got some several. Uh, the only thing we have right now is this uh, black tower, mostly private military companies. So the four next union fleet was totally obliterated by the uh, battle uh, of the battle of Bramanaf or something. So that's a big uh, blow to the uh, whole attack right now. It will uh, take some time, I guess, before the uh, Fornax Union fleet uh, assembles or reassembles. In the meantime, uh, this is a big crisis right now. As well, as long as this uh, uh, Dian Biden is heading towards uh, eastward, that shouldn't be a problem. But the problem is if they headed westward. Okay, the Crimson Companies pays dividends, that's good. Um, that should, uh, well, uh, that should uh, provide some, uh, you know, uh, patch up uh, resources. For the moment, uh, the whole uh, fleet here is still uh, trying to uh, cope up with the big loss. Hmm. Yeah, the Foreign Next Union fleet was totally obliterated from the battle. So uh, we're still reassembling here. Okay, huh. um, what does this mean? Armor level cap, ship fire rate, envoy. Okay. In the meantime, uh, I would like just to ask the. Uh, Okay, so for now we have the whole frigate team here, so uh, yeah, we'll just have to reinforce them a lot, and uh, I don't know, we have to push our, uh, you know, our, uh, uh, how, the, how do we call it, we have to push our production level here on the high, uh, high levels. <laughs> Okay, so the extra material uh, construction ship here is uh, located here. Construction complete. Okay, what do we got here? Well, we already have a reason. Uh, okay, good. So, uh, the whole... Uh, Okay, we'll probably have, uh, they'll be probably entering this space for about, uh, 65 days. <sighs> okay, 
uh, probably have to send a scientist here, Archimedes. Sag, uh, son of Jut, will probably have to be sent and see. Okay, that's going to be a very perilous uh, journey, but he's a psychic, very good, and expertise. Mm, yeah, we could use some sort of destruction here. Yeah, we need to destroy this one so we could get some uh, information about this. What's this? In fleet contract. Huh. In the meantime, uh, where's my... Uh, okay, so most of my PMC companies here are still missing from the last jump. Okay, this is a very, very big uh, problem right now. So, uh, there we go. Mm. Well, anyway, as long as the Unbidden is uh, heading towards east, this shouldn't be a big issue. But right now, they're causing uh, whole problems, uh, whole large problems in the central galaxy right now. So unless there's a miracle that we could hope happens, uh, uh, this is not gonna go away. So it's a very gonna be a very long battle for the uh, galactic crisis here. But at least we did repel the uh, early invaders, so they're now headed eastward. So although it is uh, a failed uh, a failed military campaign, it did show the uh, stiff military resistance. Oh, what's this? Oh, okay, we got some uh, refugees now, Furbanites. Uh, so right from New Congo. Oh wait, New Congo. What's this? Uh, car... Oh, god. It's gonna be uh, orbital bombardment. So even the Sidran Manifold, uh, one of the rivals and enemies of the UNS, is being attacked uh, recklessly as well. Huh. Okay. Mm. Right, uh, we got a few orders here. Station reports enemy contact. Okay, fleet combat. Oh, okay, the fire fleet was, uh... Yeah, they kind of have some uh, problems with that. Huh. Okay, uh, that's okay. We're good with that. <laughs> oh god, this one just jumped out of uh, something here. See? Uh, there is no connection here, but it seems that the uh, extra dimensional image just jump it out from the looks of it. Uh huh. This is very bad. They jump it out. Okay, the Black uh, Tower Initiative. Okay, uh, where's the Black Black Tower Initiative? Okay, we're, they're gonna launch a surprise attack here. Special project complete. The flies once more, the once rapacious shroud has returned to watch over the Torel system, but this time she will guard the rubricator for us. Oh, gate. It hungers. Yeah. We're gonna enlist those guys. Like, uh... Ha ha ha, 88,000. That's good, baby. That's real good. So we're gonna resurrect eight of them, and we got a whole, I don't know, a whole horde of it. Okay, we'll just keep reviving them a la Universal Soldier style. They're now gonna, they're already dead, but the dead death doesn't uh, put a stop on them to call for arms. And we're gonna employ them as UNS. 
Okay, so we're not sure if the Dragon uh, Spearhead fleet here, the PMC fleet, will be successful with this. But we're putting our all hopes with this one. Uh, or at least, uh, you know, hopefully uh, some of them will not do, uh, you know, some sort of jump drive uh, stuff there. So how many more are we gonna resurrect? There were eight. Okay, we're still resurrecting. One, two, three. Okay. New Bahrain. It's a tech world. Um, okay, fine. We'll just have to give them some team clinics just to shut them up. Uh, Forge world. Um, oh god, we still got low populations here. Um... How does this require us? Uh, it needs a population, I guess, of... Uh, right, let me check who's... Uh, who's... Uh, who in uh, UNS space here has a ton of unemployed pops? Oh, no Taiwan. Okay, we'll just go get five guys. Okay, five pops there. Okay, New Spain. Right, okay, New Spain, you got some, uh, some, uh, stuff here. Okay, we're gonna need that. Uh, oh, New Senegal, okay. Uh, we're recently, uh, okay, that's kind of funny. They settled into a prison planet. <laughs> Boundaries. Okay, we're going to resettle them. I don't know, maybe... Uh, uh, I don't know, we're, we're currently lacking the manpower, to be honest. So let's just, uh, you know, see Minus where this goes. Lost enemy action. Yes, yes, of course, that's pretty obvious from the looks of it. I've uh, already got... Uh, uh, Right, uh, where's my, uh... Oh, okay, my kaiju's, uh, currently, uh, you know, going to the Zanya system. It's an own dragon. Uh... Okay, um... Alright, uh... The UNS lead, the Griffin Company, is still, uh, doing good. Dragon Spearhead is totally, uh, I'll let this one get, uh, destroyed totally, so we can have a brand new, uh... Okay, Dragon Spearhead Company. Okay, uh... Wazir Patron, we want to... Play Technology Share with you. Okay, this is... Um... Okay, goodbye. Okay, so this, uh... In technology that we have we have to disseminate to this uh, you know okay as yes, patron it's a deal we need this for our whole mercenary fleet right now disseminate all the information that we can so that uh, they'll be a formidable fighting force Okay. Uh, so it's gonna be a win-win battle for the dragons. Okay, but well at least they could hold up a fight. Yeah, okay, that's not gonna carve them up, but uh... Okay, that's good. Now we got some sort of surprise. Ah, okay, let me... Uh, just give me a moment here. 69 days. Okay, so to launch a surprise attack will take 69 days. Oh, okay, fine. I'm okay with that. We need a surprise attack. Uh, hit them... Uh, you know, hit them with uh, anything we got out here. Uh, for the moment, where's my Hawken? 
I probably need another um Okay, I'll probably need another science vessel here. I guess on the Rosalgi. Research station lost to enemy action. One, two, three. Okay. Okay, the Dragon Spear hit feed our mercenary fleet here are doing their best to uh you know attack this one. It's mostly a suicide run, but uh well uh, let's see how it works. Uh weapon Okay, uh your first orders are here. Torapia system. Well we're gonna need our uh who uh this dragon guys. <sighs> okay. Oh god. Okay, um slave market. Uh, probably have to go with this one. Do, 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 do. I think we got some sort of a uh, company here, I guess. I think I just saw a private company. Let me. Okay, uh, Black Tower Initiative. Yeah, we missed to manage our rented fleet. Uh, wait, 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 where's our. Uh, Okay, goodbye. Oh, do we have a Black Tower complete. fleet? I think the Black Tower fleet was annihilated as well. Okay, Genghis is not doing that kind of stuff. Okay, so this is a very, very, uh, you know, problematic crisis that we're having here. It's a good thing that this uh, unbeaten uh, construction uh, fleet here is... Um, no, 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 go here. Go here. Probably need you to reverse engineer this ASAP. Excellento, yes, of course. A hyperplanet range. Huh. Society research game. No, we were just gonna go, uh... Uh, yeah, New Mongolia will be nice. New Canada will be one, of course. <laughs> okay, so, uh... Yeah, this is a very tense time for the UNS. Because, uh... And the Fornax Union. Although, uh, crisis speaking, the, uh, the Inbidden is just spreading uh, eastward, near to the galactic center. Okay, what is happening right now? Senate personal oversight. Okay, I, I don't know what that means. But I have the emergency measure here. I need to wait 7,200 days, that's not gonna count. Up oh, next repeal ready. What the hell? Focus the invite, and of course, supporters. God. What the hell? They're not taking this seriously. Can you imagine that? The galaxy's in flames, and they're, uh. Yeah, oh, this is gonna create a rift, to be honest. Let me, uh... Okay, let me... Okay, we're gonna call in a favor. Could invite you to a federation, of course. Confirm. And, uh... Okay, um... Uh... Okay, let me, uh... Take this one. Call in favors, yeah. Uh, what's this one? Already, uh, okay. Midfell and Lady Kingdom. Call in favor. Um, how many favors do we got here? Uh, 
Tales and Republic, well... Game for now, we're, uh... Well, yes. Foreign ex Union voted to vote into the Federation. Okay, so now the f the new member now of the Federation is the Falar Kingdom. Two of Falar Kingdom, the two of the biggest, largest uh, stellar nations in the Fornax galaxy. So now we got the uh, yeah. Okay, where's the Falar? I thought that uh, we just already invited them. Wait, let me take. Prime Union voted to invite Fargon to the Federation. Okay, so mm -hmm. the Erasu Galactic Commonality uh, still needs a... Uh... Okay, well anyway, although this is a bit, uh, you know... Oh god, it's just teleported out of nowhere, I guess. See, it's 11. So that's the problem, they have some sort of jump drive technology here. But of course, the Black Tower Initiative was wiped out uh, uh, by this guy. Oh, it was supposed to be a surprise attack, but for some reason they kept jumping. So anyway, I guess uh, we'll just call this one uh, for our recorded Let's Play session. Um, we'll probably have to... Uh, you know, I have to probably have to think about this one as well, on how to solve this, and how to, uh, of course, uh, solve this crisis right now. In any case, have a great day, everyone, and uh, I appreciate and it's my gratitude that you have enough. Uh, you know, you took the time in watching my recorded Let's Play. So again, this is the Fairy Archivist. Have a great day, everyone, and see you around on my uh, next recorded Let's Play session. Bye for now.